ego can be the thought i'm a helpless failure and it, and the only way we suffer is we hold on to a thought like that and think it's true when we realize it's just a thought we fall out of ego and there's something always here underneath that made up version of life that's present and it's enough and it's beautiful and it's a feeling so sid would say if he summarized his whole spiritual teaching, it's all thought and listen for the feeling of just presence. It's always there because we all do that. I still do. I get caught up in thoughts and all of a sudden I, I have this, my shoulders are up and I think it has to do with what I'm doing. And then it's like, oh yeah, this too. It's just thought, this too shall pass. <sighs> and the worry lifts. Get on, this is what I mean by being unburdened by thoughts that weigh on us. Hmm? So that you yeah. can be a full human being and have all kinds of feelings and get upset and be stressed, but you're resilient and it flows and it becomes less and less problematic. And boy, in a relationship, when I get unburdened, I'm more present and my wife and kids notice and it does something. My dog, okay, we're coming back to dogs because we started with dogs. We got to end with dogs. I sit down next to my puppy in the morning and I go, oh, I got to check emails to see if, if people are registering for the course late I got to send them the link and I pick up my phone and always within just a few seconds I feel this paw hit my arm and pull it down <laughs> dogs and cats thrive in presence but so do people that's the great thing it's it's this waking up out of thought and becoming more fully present in life and getting more familiar with that and trusting that out of that you'll find what you need is what a, is the foundation for having a healthy relationship with anyone a co-worker an enemy a friend someone in your family someone suffering someone who's happy as can be and it's we'll go into the benefits later but it's like unbelievable sid called this space the ultimate answer it's where you find the answer to every single thing a human being is looking for what are you looking for insight inspiration motivation aspiration clarity perspective common sense peace joy love connection solutions to problems new and fresh view of life what are you looking for? You won't find it on the outside. This is a spiritual teaching. You won't ever find it by seeking anything on the outside. Look within, step within. And then get more familiar and more familiar and more familiar with that space. And then bring what you find in that space to other people and give it away because it's given to you for free, you extend it for free, that's generosity of spirit. No matter who you are, where you are, whether you're at work, whether you're at home, whether you're with friends, whether you're by yourself, we are, the cosmic joke is we already, we already have and are everything we're looking for. <laughs> Just relax about this whole affair and more and more will be revealed to you from within by blessing.